Testing, testing. One, two, are we on the air? Let's do it. Coming up on this episode of the Hip Hop Report, Amaru Entertainment drops another Tupac album. Will Smith talks about the pursuit of happiness and the queen, Queen Latifah that is, is holding it down for hip hop. All that and more coming up next on the Hip Hop Report. This past September marked the 10th anniversary of Tupac Shakur's death. Radio stations, internet sites, and fans from all over the world paid tribute to the late hip-hop icon. Pac's family had plans to commemorate his life by traveling to South Africa to spread his ashes in Soweto, a town that Tupac had much love for. But the ceremony was postponed till June 16, 2007, which will mark what would have been his 36th birthday. However, Afini Shakur, Pac's mom, has plans to release his sixth posthumous album titled Pac's Life that features guest appearances by a Shanti and T.I. who put it down on the title track. Bone Thugs and Harmony, Kanye West, E-40, The Outlaw, Snoop, and Chameleonaire also touched down on the album, which is due to hit stores November 21st. Let's check out this video from Pac. Now we was once two brothers of the same kind Quick to approach a ghetto cutie with the same line You was just a little smaller but you still rolled Got stretched to YA, hit the hood swole Remember when you had a Jerry curl, never quite learned Drinking 90 proof on the roof, tripping off Sherm Collect calls to the tilt, singing how you changed Or you a Muslim now, no more dope games I just got the phone call, heard you got bail Wanna go to the mosque, no time for females I'm losing touch with my homie, he's a changed man He hit the pen and now no sinning is the game plan When I say I'm living large, all you see is the struggle When I say I'm still thugging, all you see is the trouble Congratulations on the wedding I hope your wife know she got a player for life And everybody miss you I know we grew apart, you probably don't remember I used to think for your sister but never did get with her And I can see us after school we bombed On the first play of haters with the wrong set on Now the whole thing's changed Cause we don't even kick it Got a big money scheme and you ain't even with it Knew in my heart you was the same young brother that When it's time for woe go toe to toe and watch your brother's back I can't even lie I ain't laughing at you, you trying hard to maintain, but go ahead, cause I ain't mad at you. Movie star and Grammy Award winning rapper Will Smith will hit the big screen with a real tearjerker this holiday season in a film called The Pursuit of Happiness. It's based on the true story of stockbroker Christopher Gardner. Here's Will to tell us more about his new movie. The uh, film is called The Pursuit of Happiness. Uh, it's uh, there, There's a, a guy named Chris Gardner. Chris Gardner owns one of the uh, biggest black-owned uh, stockbroker firms in the world. And 20 years ago, he was homeless. And it's the story of his deterioration to homeless. And he actually lived on the street for, for six months with his son. And it's his deterioration to homeless and then his rise uh, to, to success. Uh, it's, I mean, it's, uh, it is an amazingly powerful story. It's, it's the, the, the perfect depiction of the, the American dream. The Pursuit of Happiness was produced by Overbrook Entertainment, which is owned by him and his wife, Jada Pinkett Smith. Their son, Jaden, also stars in the movie, which is in theaters December 15th. Let the bass kick. Earlier 
this year, the queen became the first female rapper to receive a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Here's Queen Latifah on what she feels her accomplishments mean for hip-hop. It means something for hip-hop. It expands our world. It opens it up. It lets you know that you can grow, cross over, you can build, and that, you know, being a hip-hop artist doesn't mean you're a rapper and that's it. And that's all you can ever do. It means you can expand, you can create labels, you can create businesses, you can go into real estate. Whatever it is you want to do, that um, this has been like a springboard for us, particularly African-American from the hood, you know what I mean, to, you know, step out, grow, and, and, and go into the world. And it's, and you know, it's a universal music. It's something that connects us worldwide, so. Currently, Queen Latifah is the spokesmodel for CoverGirl and has authored two books, including her autobiography, Ladies First, Revelations of a Strong Woman, and a children's book titled Queen of the Scene. The story teaches kids to respect themselves, have fun, and take pride in who they are. That's it for this episode of the Hip Hop Report. Stay tuned for the latest news, more drama, and hip hop. Peace.